Today we went out to Bangalbiri with the community, elders, students, teachers, and the rangers all went to visit Sacred Side. Kim told us about the rock that was found in the sand by archaeologist. So this big hole here you're in, that was much deeper. Explained how all the rock was, the rock was 45,000 years old. So this, your country here, it's really strong place for that. Everyone began to then look for rocks that old people used to use. Mr. Les found a spear next to Kim's pit. The elders explained the rocks. There was a rock that helps with cooking and grinding seeds. There was a rock for painting. What a nice one. Some found spears. Kifu showed Monica a rock that Look. was sacred. Monica then asked Kifu to put it back. Mm. Um, we're, we're going down to the archaeological dig. Oh, this is it here. Look, just Shirley told just here. about how. The water came in old times. Where they, you know that, where they was digging up there, where they found that rock here is long here. The water was very high. It covered the land. How the water had become lower and was now a lake. Shirley told us where they found the artifacts that was 45,000 years old. So this little piece of stone here, this one, if you look closely, it's got a groove in there and that's from an old grinding stone. Kim explained what an artifact is, that it is the things that old people made. They made things from rocks for different uses. Are they artefacts? Yes. Yes. Somebody got another big stone and knocked it off of a bigger piece of stone. And then they turned it over and they went to make sharp edges. Evelyn told the story of one special rock that the rock was made for killing animals. It was a spearhead. Jake is one of the elders of Biluna. Told us how the old people used to live. It be old people way back. It be lake here. Lake called Pangabadi. He told us a dream time story about the two dogs. As the two dogs when they kill a dream out on the lake, the two dogs when they walk up there. The two dogs went to the lake. 
they saw a an emu and they killed it and they went back to Mullen. It was a great day. We enjoyed filming and looking for rocks and what we learnt about the old people who used to live there and the tale of the two dogs.